Fuck yeah, dude. Kind of ugly. Wait, what the hell? What? Did he? What? Damn, you didn't man. film it. You took a photo. <laughs> what the hell? Look, you took a photo. You just took a little light photo. All right. Look. No, I didn't. Look, there you go. What am I supposed to do? Hold it? No, you got a video. Why didn't you do that for me already? But, but I thought you know. Cause on, nigga, you got. I said you put it on camera, and you didn't. You put it on photo, asshole. Damn it! Keep that was like. Do it again. Hey guys, Ivan Skevius here. I'm here to talk about the difference between a dad filmer and an experienced filmer. So, I'm gonna demonstrate that. With an experienced filmer, they're all about their skater. That's all they care about, nothing else matters. And they know how to work the camera, and they know how to skate as well when filming. So, to demonstrate that, let's say, a guy does a front 50 on the box, tray flip, and backside blunt. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna look both ways. I'm gonna see if there's any people. All right, you're good. Hold on. See what I mean? Traffic comes by, you never know. It's crazy in a skate park. You just saw a little girl get ran by this nigga Seth, so you don't know what's bound to happen. All right, we're good. Your lens is still on. See? Experienced filmer. You gotta have the lens cap off, you gotta be recording, and you gotta be aware of your surroundings, because that by I don't know if you saw everything I just saw, but that was pretty crazy. Give pro filmer right here, give us more tips. I'm not pro. All right. Well, okay. I don't, I don't even have okay. a camera. Oh. Oh. Guys, Justin Martinez. Another thing about filmers, some filmers like to have cred because you want to get in that position to film more good skaters, right? And also, you want that film credit. I'm not gonna say any names, but I know a person like that. Justin, would you like to share your experience with filming and what you prefer and what you've seen in skating that you don't like? Everything is sick. <laughs> nah, I've heard you say, oh, I don't, I could have filmed better than that. That's just like. I don't know. You know what I'm talking about. No, you. these people yeah. don't know. They know what I'm talking about, too. They probably had the same experiences looking at something going, oh, I don't like the way that was filmed. Maybe I should let someone take over that doesn't know how to film and let them experience a whole skate vlog without... Some, some people that you would say don't know how to film have a pretty sick style at filming. That and never touch the camera. Exactly. That it's, shake around. Yeah, because it's so abstract that it's different no and way. different is good. Okay. It just works. To demonstrate that, let's say... Don't, someone, act, don't act like there's a fucking earthquake occurring. That no. too. All right, no, so, there's been no, times. No okay. earthquake shit. Let's say, let's say someone does a trick off the six. I'll give the camera to someone that doesn't know how to film, and I'll give the camera to someone that knows how to film. Like me. And then you compare the two. Simple. Just keep them in the middle of the frame. And follow them down. Don't shake, everything will be good. It doesn't matter what angle you film it from, whatever is good for you. But why is it that some people don't understand that concept and they still fucking shake? Because people think about things too much. True. Have you ever failed at something? Yeah. Did you think about that one thing too much? Yeah. That's probably why you failed. But how the fuck do you fuck up on filming? I don't know. How does... Think, think about something. Think about... Think about driving a car. Before you know how to dr drive a car, it was gnarly, right? True. Then now that you know how to drive a car, you don't even think about it. You just do it, right? Uh -huh. Same thing. So what are you saying is Same. practice makes perfect? I guess. If there's In anything that you don't understand, figure it out. Once you figure it out, boom, you're gold. Stay gold. There you have it. Justin Martinez spitting knowledge about his filming techniques. This dude is one of the best filmers. I, not even that good. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> no, and that's humbleness that right there, but he's one of my good. favorite filmers. And I don't even own a camera. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> nigga. Let's demonstrate the difference between a good skater and a dad filmer.
That's the shit you don't want to do. You ever see a dad filmer from a graduation and you just see him like this? Yeah, you don't want to do that shit. This is how you film. This is how the experienced filmer films. He might do a rolling shot. He might add that in there because they just look pretty sick. You ever watch um, any of the girl or chocolate videos? Some rolling shots with the stabilizer? Watch. Right here. I got you. All right, here he comes. Film, bam. While I'm rolling and filming, I have one eye right here, scanning, zooming in and out, and then the other eye is spectating traffic and how I'm gonna zoom in and out of the clip to make it a nice transition for editing. That's what I like. Rolling shots with the widescreen lens. And also how you film it. Um, angles matters. It's what adds to the clip. I'm pretty sure you've seen those videos that look like they were uh, filmed by a toaster. They're all really choppy. Two megapixels. But, um... That's all I have to say for the widescreen lens with the rolling shot. As far as an experienced filmer and a dad filmer, um, one thing a lot of skaters don't like is when they're trying to trick and they're talking to someone or there's someone or something in the way of the obstacle they're trying and the filmer doesn't take the initiative to get that object or that person out of the way. Dude, so where'd you get that chain? Uh, actually, my oh. dad gave it to me. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Are you filming? Uh, my bad, dude. I was asking about his chain. God, dude. My bad, bro. You gotta, like, step aside. Oh, my bad. Are you gonna try yeah, my, I'm sorry, dude, for that. I've been trying this trick for a while. I'm just... Oh, shit. My, my filmer doesn't even take this shit serious. Oh, my bad, bro. Thanks, bro dude. My bad. Hey, All right. Fuck, dude, my Snapchat sucks dick. Look at this. How you gonna fucking. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing, dude? Don't worry, my Snapchat glitched. So, even if I wanted to leak the footy, Snapchat's got your back. Alright, all right, bro, I can't be having them. This is for my part, I don't want to see. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm It builds happy. hype, though. Yeah, but. I don't know, it's a really difficult trick. I don't want I don't want this shit to be seen, dog. You can get extra followers. I got a pretty good fan base. Zion Wright, he did something down the 16. Those niggas for Nike, they said, hey, you gotta put that camera down. So I'm... I would have told those niggas from Nike that this is public property. <laughs> Nigga. Just don't film this shit, dog. I've been trying this shit for years, bro. Hey, you gotta kick out some Skrilla. Uh... Nah. No, I need in. <laughs> I need in. Alright. Alright. Nike got that paycheck. Alright, Eric. Alright. Who's Eric? Alright. Doug, 20 hot kind of ground. Trying to steal footy? He's gonna put his face over my head and say it was him skating, but it wasn't. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is this? I don't even know what that is, bro. <laughs> I don't even know how to do that. <laughs> Another thing that really sucks is when the filmer is too close with the fisheye or is too far with the fisheye. If you have a fisheye, you have to use it properly, right? The fisheye is made for close encounters and that's exactly what I'm doing right now. You got the fisheye here, I'm this close, about five inches and you, it's for tight spaces. Okay, that shit, that was real, that was real as fuck. That was, <laughs> So, I feel like I'm probably talking your ear off, but these are just good things and good, uh, I don't know if it's good, but I'm just trying to give you advice, right? I'm trying to give you advice if you're trying to have a sponsor video or if you just want a video to share on a YouTube, whatever it is. Um, I hope you apply these techniques that Justin, Mowgli, and I came up with and take it to the streets, take it to a wedding. Make that side money. Anyhow, 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Share, like, and subscribe. Comment below if you have any experiences or anything you want to share. Any questions, let us know. And have a good day. Omi Tofa. I'll see you guys. Peace.